Welcome to part two of turning my makeup room into a baby nursery. I will have the first part linked down below. It was sort of like just like a, a cleanup organization type video of this room. I'm about to show you what this room looks like currently and it's current state is a little bit interesting um it's a little bit overwhelming but we gotta sit down or not sit down we gotta get up and start working on it i am currently almost 25 weeks pregnant and i have a lot to do i'm trying to start early and i keep telling myself i'm gonna start early but then the weeks just keep slipping on by so we're gonna work on this room today i have a bit of an unboxing um you'll get a glimpse of everything that i have so far as far as like baby stuff goes i have received or i should say we have received several more packages from our baby registry from you guys and we are so incredibly thankful and grateful for that so I will unbox the packages that I have not opened yet on a video um, I've included the unboxings in a few different videos so uh, check out my pregnancy playlist if you want to see um, some fun baby hauls so anyway if you guys are new don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy and let's go ahead and get started so here's the thing um this looks like a completely disorganized mess but there actually is a system to it also you may notice this baby boy bag um this is not mine well it was it was a neighbor's they actually had a bunch of spare newborn size diapers that they didn't use and their son grew out of them, so uh, we went and picked them up, and they came. Some of them came in this bag, so that's what that is. <laughs> Very grateful for those newborn diapers. Um, so we have that. Um, I have baby stuff up here, baby stuff all over here. It all needs to be organized. It's pretty much just like put into bags and boxes and like piled up together. This is makeup that I'm decluttering, decluttering, decluttering. Stuff I have to go through. Makeup I still have to declutter, just random stuff up there. Um, I have some PR packages over here, some stuff from my, um, like, my, I have like yearbooks and stuff over here from my parents' house, some of my like home run baseballs, random, random things, a diamond painting, some empties, and then we have this mess over here. So, um, yeah, everything is pretty much a complete disaster and there's not really much space to move around so I think what I'm gonna do is clear this whole area out actually let me zoom you guys out I don't know why we're zoomed in all the way um, I'm gonna clear off this top shelf because nothing up there is baby related so I'm just gonna go ahead and take all of that stuff down and then put the baby related stuff up there um it's all just like in boxes this is stuff that we've received from you guys and so from some friends and family so um a bunch of stuff that still needs to be organized once i get to my true full form nesting phase we will be doing that in videos so no worries <laughs> but i figured i would go ahead and try to at least semi organize it up here so i think that'll be our first step once we make some room in here <laughs> i'll go bring the boxes from the other room into here so that we can do the baby registry unboxing Okay, so things are already looking a lot better. Nothing is organized whatsoever. Um, I just like put the boxes up here, just kind of how they would fit. So there's like diapers, there's welcome boxes from registries, our diaper bag, the little like baby tub, more diapers, all kinds of stuff in these boxes. 
Same with these bags in this box. This again is stuff that I still have to do declutter videos on, so I still have to do like brows, mascara, eyeliner, single shadows, that type of thing. So um, these are just pulled out of their drawers for right now. I haven't decided what I'm doing with the Alex 9 drawers. I don't know if I'm gonna keep them in here and use them for baby storage or if we're going to sell them or sell some of them. Not 100% sure. Right now, this one is completely empty. This one is completely empty. I have makeup in here, body care, skincare, and hair care in this one. Um, eyeshadow palettes in here, which is going to be empty soon and be put into this unit. And then I have miscellaneous stuff over here, like brush cleaner and makeup bags, things like that. And then there's just like a mystery pile of stuff that has been thrown here, so that's going to be addressed another day. I did clear out most of this space here, which is really nice. I still have to figure out where to put these boxes. These are just like larger, heavier boxes that didn't really fit up here for now, so... For now, those are gonna stay there. I do have some PR packages that I need to move. I pretty much just moved everything over here for now, so this is like my catch-all corner of the room, if you will, for now. Um, I need to go through all of these containers, figure out what I'm gonna keep and get rid of. I also have to figure out what desk is gonna be used as my vanity, so I don't know if I'm gonna use this one as a vanity or this one as a vanity. This was my old vanity that I used to use years ago when I was filming videos. Then I upgraded to this one. I just don't know if this one's gonna be too big for the room that I'm moving my stuff into, which is currently Jarvis's office. So we'll definitely have to figure that out soon. I'll have to take some measurements, maybe even just bring them into the room to see like how it physically like looks and feels so we have to work on that um, but for now I'm gonna go grab the packages from the other room and we will do a little unboxing so I called it a little unboxing but really we have like 14 or 15 packages to open so here is a look at everything that I'm about to open so let's get to the haul okay so haul time um most of these are from amazon a couple of them are from target um i will have our registries linked down below in case you're interested in what we have on our registries we registered at amazon and target um so if you are looking for ideas for what to put on your baby registry or just like you know things that i've done research on and you know kind of been drawn to and found a liking for. Um, I am a first time mom, um, or I guess, you know, pregnant mom. <laughs> well, we are expecting our first daughter in November, so very exciting. Um, so yeah, I guess I'll just go ahead and open up these packages. I'm gonna say thank you a million times because like I said, these are all from you guys. At least I'm pretty sure um, there may be a few friends slash family that have sent packages that are in this mix, um, which you guys are all my friends as well. <laughs> but, um, you know what, I'm gonna unplug this because that looks a little, it's like giving me anxiety seeing that cord stretched like that. All right, anyway, um, we'll start off with the Target packages. I think there's like two of these, so let's get into it. Okay, first up we have this package, which is from, I don't know, the name is cut off. Oh no, it, oh wait, here we go. Oh, show gift giver names. Show me. There we go. Okay, this is from Summer. Summer, thank you so much. It says, I have watched you for years and you have the sweetest heart. I am so excited for y'all in this next journey that you are about to take. I saw it says SU, so <laughs> um, I figured that was part of the name. So Summer, thank you. First up, we have this super cute set. This is honestly something I'm so excited for. Look at these onesies. These are the newborn to zero size and they are so freaking cute it was a three pack and i love the color palette of these these are from the brand cloud island i've heard that these are incredible they do zip and like i said the colorways are so freaking cute there's this like orangey one with yellow we have the pink one with the orange trim and then we have the yellow one 
with the pink trim. It has this little button here that covers up the zipper and it actually zips from the bottom, which is really cool. So you can zip it upward and then take the feet off, do a diaper change, that type of situation. So I'm very excited about these. Like I said, the brand is Cloud Island and I have heard amazing, amazing things about these onesies. So I was so excited. I actually registered for these in two sizes because I loved the colors so much. They're so soft and I just think these are going to be fantastic. Also, the hands, you can pull this little bit over and make it into a mitten and um, the feet are little like footed bottoms as well. So very excited about this thank you so much summer our next target package is a box so let's open <laughs> open this up oh my gosh i'm going to make a mess over here okay we have uh, looks like lots of things in here this is again from summer Paige and jarvis congratulations here are some cute some super cute things from your registry and some organic teething gel that saved my baby from tooth pain. Ooh, summer. Okay, so, oh my gosh, there's so many things. So we have Mommy's Bliss Organic Little Gums Soothing Massage Gel. So this is, um, oh, daytime and nighttime. So it looks like there's two tubes in here, one for daytime, one for nighttime. This is that teething gel that she was talking about. I'm so excited to try this. I have seen this brand. I've seen, I think it's called Gripe Water from this brand. Let me know if you guys have any input on Gripe Water. I've heard like mixed things. Um, so let me know what your experience is on that. But I am so excited. I love the personal recommendation from you summer that is so freaking awesome next up we have some desitin i think is how you say it we have some diaper rash cream i've heard that this is amazing for diaper rashes obviously you want to avoid diaper rashes if at all possible but I know that it happens, so it's always good to have something like that on hand. Next, we have this little toy, which I'm going to open up. This is so cute. This is from Skip Hop. This is the Silver Lining Cloud Jitter Stroller Toy. Look at how cute this is. It's a cloud that has little, like, there's like a star. Oh! It squeaks. Poncho's gonna think that's for him. <laughs> There's like a crinkly one and then this little ring here. This is so freaking cute. I love the sun and the cloud. Oh, and there's also another side. There's It's a two-sided cloud. There's the sunny side and the rainy side with the little moon. I didn't even know that. That is so cute. Thank you so much. And then we have some other little onesies in here. These ones are so freaking cute. These are just like kind of like basics, but like I thought they were absolutely adorable. They're just little like short sleeve onesies and they are a ribbed material, which hopefully you can kind of see that. And they have like the little buttons. These are from Baby Cat and Jack. So this is 12 month size. And then there's also this one, which is the same exact onesie, um, but in this really cute peach color so we have peach and like a mauvey pink kind of color so thank you so much summer for all of the lovely goodies i am so excited about all of this stuff all right next up we have amazon so let's start opening up these amazon packages this first one is from becky it says um, we have the same camera and love it. Can't wait to see sweet baby girl. Wait a second. Oh, amazing. Oh, I'm so excited to hear that you love this. Okay. Ah, I'm so excited. So this is a car monitor. Um, you actually, instead of having a mirror on the headrest of like the back seat that faces your rear facing car seat, um, this is a camera that attaches to the headrest and then the little screen sits on your dash so you can easily see the uh your baby in you know 
check on them make sure they're doing good when you're driving so um you can check on them from the front seat so very exciting about or very excited about this i'm so happy like i said to hear that you enjoy this i actually um saw like a few tiktoks about it and i saw a few tiktoks where the mirrors that people have in their cars will literally like catch things on fire and burn things inside of their vehicles if the sun hits it right so that was a little concerning to me <laughs> so i thought the camera would be an awesome option so thank you so much becky i am so excited about this next up we have this package which is from let me get the note this is from carolina it says to the best parents a baby girl could ever have from carolina thank you so much carolina you're gonna make me cry <laughs> Um, this is a super cute little like mobile I think is how you pronounce this um, It's the thing that like hangs above the crib This one's gonna be kind of hard to see but there's like little like wool slash felt clouds This is gonna be so cute the theme for our nursery is like all sky related themes like sun moon clouds stars that type of thing um so this is gonna be so freaking cute i love this so much um it's even cuter in person than i thought it was gonna be so i can't wait to hang this up it's going to be absolutely adorable thank you so much carolina next up we have i'm gonna open up all of the like package like bag packages first um, next up we have some sunscreen, some baby sunscreen. This is from Lauren again. Lauren! Lauren has gotten us so much stuff. Um, I just am so... <laughs> I'm just blown away. Lauren, thank you. Um, so this is really cool. This is from Hello Bello. This is the SPF 30 face and body sun stick. So this is supposed to be really good and easy to use. Um, it's a zinc oxide sunscreen. It says it works on wet skin. Um, it's a reef friendly sunscreen as well. And this is just like a sunscreen stick instead of like a lotion that you have to like rub in or like spray. This is just like a sunscreen stick so now we have sunscreen stick as well as sunscreen lotion for our baby girl so thank you so much Lauren next we have let's see what is the what is this oh my goodness Okay, this is from Erin. Congratulations again on your new adventure with Jarvis. I know this isn't on your list, but I used to love bundling my kiddo up in a soft robe when reading to him and thought this was perfect for your baby girl. Erin, this is so cute. Oh, I love the colors. Oh my gosh, it's a plush robe. Okay, I'm gonna have to like open this. It's so soft. This is so cute. It has a little hood on it. Look at the colors. It's like pink, green, and blue. Little rainbows. This is so cute. Very fitting for our theme. Oh my god. I love this. This is adorable. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Wow. That is so thoughtful. I appreciate that so much. I know Jarvis is going to think that that is so cute as well. Thank you so much, Erin. Next up, we have another, another Amazon package. Obviously, let's see what is in here. Let me find the note first. This is from uh, Latasha, Latasha, Latasha. I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. It says, I couldn't help myself. Your last video, your fur baby looked sad. He didn't have any gifts. LOL. Congrats on your baby girl. Oh, I'm literally like, I'm literally gonna cry. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm not okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my gosh, I'm, my, I'm like shaking. <laughs> this is so cute. <laughs> she got Poncho a present. <laughs> Look at how cute this is. Oh my god. I, I'm gonna have to give this to him. I'm gonna give this to him during this video. So <laughs> keep watching. Oh my god, I am a mess. This that is so sweet. Whew. I keep seeing like 
these TikToks of people like, um, don't forget about your like fur baby when your like first like human baby comes around or like people always forget about their fur babies and I'm like, I could never forget about Pancho. That is our first kid, that is our son. <laughs> And, um, yeah, I just, I, like, worry that he, I don't want him to feel, like, you know, I don't know how he's gonna react, obviously, I can't, like, tell, you know, who knows, but hopefully the transition goes smoothly, I think it will, he's not, like, the jealous type, so that's good, but that is so sweet of you, wow, that, like, meant so much to me, <laughs> so <laughs> thank you so much for that. He is going to love that. I cannot wait to give that to him. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Whew. Way to make me cry. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Next, we have a gift from Heather. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Wait. This is so cute. No way. <laughs> we have... There's no note. It just says, enjoy a gift from Heather. This is so cute. We have another robe. Oh my gosh. This is adorable. Wow. Our baby girl is going to be set. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Is this the same? Oh no, no, no. It's not the same brand. But look at how cute this is. It's a little unicorn. We'll have to alternate. She's going to have all of the options. This is so cute. I can't wait to like see what she looks like in all of her little outfits. This is so adorable. Thank you so much, Heather. Heather has gotten us so much stuff as well. Like, wow. It's so like, it's so cool that you guys like thought to get anything, you know, anything from our registry, but also like things that aren't on the, the registry as well. Just because like, I don't know. I just think that the thought of that's put into that is so incredibly sweet so thank you so much <laughs> um i have more packages to open i still have one two three four five six packages left but my camera battery is gonna die so let me go change that and i will be right back okay mr poncho someone saw you in my last unboxing and thought that you might want a little present yourself so I got a little something for you. It's a turtle. Look at that. That is a good boy. <laughs> is that your toy? Oh, boy. That's a good boy. <laughs> he says thank you. Pacho seems to absolutely love his new toy. So thank you so much again for that. Um, Latasha, Latasha. Again, I'm, I hope... I, Hopefully it's one of those. Let me know, correct me in the comments. But thank you so much, that was so sweet. <laughs> wow, that vehicle is loud. <laughs> but yeah, that's so awesome. He uh, he already loves it. He was sniffing away. <laughs> he took it from my hand and ran. <laughs> so thank you. Um, okay, next we have this pretty large box here. Um, let's see what's in here. It got a little bit squished. So hopefully everything inside is all good. I'm sure it is. All right, let's see. Oh my goodness. We got some wipes. <laughs> it's always so exciting to see diapers and wipes in here. We got another pack of water wipes. This is our second pack of wipes. I know that uh, we're gonna go through lots of wipes and diapers. So always such an awesome gift, such a good useful gift. So. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see who these are from. I forgot to look at the note first. Oh, it just says enjoy your gift. Oh, Daniela. Daniela. Daniela has gotten us so much stuff as well. Thank you so much for the water wipes. There's also some other stuff in here. We have a super cute little pink elephant named Hazel. This is adorable. This is the Bedtime Originals Pink Elephant. She's so cute. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. There's also some little mittens. These are Burt's Bees mittens. There's pink, gray, and cream in here. I know that babies like to scratch their face sometimes, so I know these are really good for that. So thank you so much. That's so cute. The wipes we did register for, but these were two fun surprises completely unexpected 
And then, what is this? Oh my gosh, wait. What is this? Whatever this is, it looks so freaking cute. I don't know. Oh, it's like a little, oh, this is so cute. It's like a little outfit. So there's this like uh, tool, I think is the material skirt. It's the cutest peach color. There's a little hair like flower, like hair bow flower. And then there's these cute little wings. Look at how fun this is. We're gonna have to get some pictures taken in this little outfit. Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. Thank you so much, Daniela. That is so sweet. Thank you again so much. We have a, a nice mix of like super cute things as well as like very functional, useful things. So thank you. Next up we have another Amazon <laughs> package. I'm like, of course, the rest of these are from Amazon. Um, so let's see what is in here. I'm gonna see if I can find a note. Oh no, I don't think I see a note. Oh, I found the note, thank goodness. There's like a ton of stuff in here. Um, okay, this is from Heather again. Okay, Heather, you just absolutely, uh, Literally every single one of these hauls, Heather has gotten us several things. Like, look at how many pieces of paper there are in this box. Okay. Okay, Heather. Let's see what's going on. Um, first up, we have The Giving Tree. I am so excited about this book. This is so cute. This is by Shel Silverstein. Or Silverstein? Silverstein? I always thought it was Shel Silverstein. Um, I used to have this book when I was little and I absolutely loved it. This is such a classic. I cannot wait to read this again. Thank you, Heather. There's actually other books in here as well. <sighs> Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm saying the Berenstein Bears because that is how I grew up saying this, but we have four Berenstein Bears books. I used to love these books. Okay, Berenstein Bears in the dark. I literally had this exact book when I was younger. Berenstein Bears, I'm like, my, I'm sorry. My nose is like running <laughs> from crying earlier about Poncho's toy. Um, Berenstein Bears and the Messy Room. I also had this one. There was like, I think there was a show or something with the Berenstein Bears as well. Um, we have Too Much TV as well. Berenstein Bears and Too Much TV. Oh, and there's another one, Berenstein Bears in the Dark. So there's actually two of these. <laughs> um, I don't know if that was intentional, but... Thank you so much, Heather. I, oh my gosh. Oh, and there's stickers. There's stickers in here. How fun is that? And a maze. I can't wait to read these. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, there's 64 Berenstain Bears books. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Heather. Wow, our girl is set on books. <laughs> she has so many already, which is so amazing. Um, uh, those Berenstain Bears books we were, were not registered for, so those were a complete surprise. Next, we have this mushy silicone snack cup. This is not going to be something that she uses until, like, a little bit later, obviously, but I've heard that these are great. They are good for, like, helping reduce reducing spillage <laughs> so it's like a silicone cup with little handles and you put like little dry snacks in here and um it helps kind of give your kid a little bit of independence while also like controlling the amount of things that spill when dropped so uh, i've heard that these are super awesome so thank you so much for that heather next we have Oh, another baby car seat canopy. This one is so cute. It's in like the sealed up bag, but it's covered in this beautiful like pink floral pattern. That is so freaking cute. That was a surprise item as well as these. Oh my gosh. We have some Disney socks. These are Minnie Mouse socks, zero to six months. There's like 10 pairs of socks in here. You can see Minnie on this pair here. There's so many different colors and patterns. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. I love it, I 
love oh, so adorable I'm just like wow <laughs> and then this set is so cute as well this is from Gerber this is another surprise item this is zero to three months we have a onesie pack I'm gonna go ahead and open this up so we can take a little peek at all of the onesies in here oh my gosh okay so this one says princess then we have oh, oh my gosh I literally want to take her to Disney in this little outfit look at the castles all over it this one is so cute oh that's my favorite and there's like glitter there's actual glitter on here the glittery polka dots that is adorable this one is so cute <laughs> I love this one. It has little stars and moons on it. And again, it's glittery and fun. And then this one says sweet on it. Pink and gold. That, wow, Heather, you killed it. You did so good picking out all of these outfits, all of these items. Just thank you so, 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 so much. I, again, cannot wait to show all of this stuff to Jarvis. Wow, Heather, if I see anything else from you, <laughs> I'm cutting you off because <laughs> you're already cut off. <laughs> you did too much. <laughs> okay, this next box is from Heather. <laughs> Come on, Heather, again? Okay, um, we have Hello Bello shampoo. This is, again, from Heather. So there's two things in here. Um, we have the Hello Bello Premium Baby Shampoo and Wash. This is soft lavender. And then we have these super cute, um, Mukin? Mukin? I don't know. M-U-K-I-N. Um, Baby Muslin Washcloths. These are so cute. First of all, look at the colors. I love the pastels. And here is what they look like. I also love anything muslin. So they are just nice, lightweight muslin. Oh, feels so good. Square washcloths. And again, there's white, yellow, pink, green, and blue. So freaking cute. Thank you so much, Heather. You seriously did too, too much. Let's see. This next one is from Christy. Let's see. Oh, let's. I need. This is like a part two of a, of a note. So let me see if I can find the first part without really looking into the box. Okay, we have lots of papers. Oh my goodness. Okay, wait. <laughs> okay, so first up, we have a book. This is so. Okay, Christy, where, where, where did you find this? Because this obviously Amazon, but this is so cute. This is. The Orange Bird. It's a Disney, um, what do they call these little golden books? I bought the Taylor Swift one before we even knew, um, like, the gender <laughs> of our baby. I was like, no matter what, I am buying this Taylor Swift little golden book for our baby. <laughs> and um, so that's the first little golden book that I bought. And so this is our second one. This is so cute. And it's citrus themed, which fits perfectly with our baby shower this is so adorable oh my goodness are you kidding me i'm so excited about this thank you so much christy let's see what else we have oh my gosh baby bandana bibs also citrus there was a theme this is so cute okay so these are comfortable and adjustable um bandana bibs they're they come with a ykk snap um, which is perfect to fit all the time while your baby grows from zero to 36 months. Oh my gosh. I like, they look so, it's like kind of like a, what material is this? Not like gauze, but like maybe kind of like a gauzy material. This looks so cute. They're machine washable, breathable, ultra soft, and super absorbent. This is so cute. Look at how cute this is together. I literally, oh my gosh, this is so cute. And there's more citrus in here. What on earth? Oh my goodness. Wait, what is this? This is infant baby girls uh, cotton gown. <sighs> this is so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> so we got a, a package delivery mid, uh, mid unboxing. <laughs> this is a huge Amazon package. <laughs> wow. Okay. Adding it to the stack. Okay. I think I found all of the notes from Christy. So we have um 
let's see I've never read this book but it looked so cute and definitely fit the orange theme so I had to get it for y'all I hope y'all love it yes that is so cute then we have um, this one that says I had to get baby girl this orange slice teaser look at how cute this is I am obsessed with this this is so perfect very fitting for the, th the, th the theme <laughs> Bibs definitely come in handy. These lemon, peach, and pomegranate ones were so adorable. Um, of course, I had to get these citrus pacifier clips. Okay, so there's like pacifier clips in here. So I'm guessing that means that it is citrus themed. How cute is that? Oh my goodness. These pacifier clips are so cute. Okay, so there's like some floral ones. Look at this orange one. Um, let's see if it'll focus. Look at how cute that is. Then there's like a rose one, lemons. Oh my god, these are so cute. Thank you so much. These are actually our first pacifier clips. So thank you. I love that. That is so fun. And then we have this super cute little citrus gown. This um, has little oranges all over it. And this is, I don't know what size this is, but it's super soft. Look at how cute this is. And it has, um, is it, does it tie? Oh, I think it ties at the bottom. It's like a knotted gown. And then it comes with this cute little matching hat that is so adorable and I think there's a note for this one as well it says um of course since I got mama a gown I had to get your mini one too wait a second whoa 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 wait a second <laughs> me a gown okay well it could be in another package I did not know this <laughs> but whoa 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 um Christy <laughs> you did way too much thank you so much for all of the gifts i love the citrus theme i love that you stuck to the theme i just think that's so cool so thank you so much christy i am blown away by that i'm very intrigued by this other gown that was spoken of <laughs> i'll see if um if it's maybe in one of these packages this next one is from Emily. We have some diapers. Let's go. Hello, Bello. Size two diapers. Yay. Thank you so much, Emily. That is so incredibly helpful. This next one. Ooh, we have, well, let me see who this is, who this is from. <laughs> um, Brittany. Brittany got us some Frida Baby uh, Nose Frida Saline Mist super awesome thank you so much Brittany and then we have Pancho is a barking man <laughs> um, we have a wrapped up gift as well it says hey Paige I didn't see anything like this on your registry but I hope you love it so much cherish those memories mama from Brittany so let's see what is in here it feels kind of like a book we have, oh, it's a, oh, a complete childhood history prompted journal. That's awesome. Oh my gosh. I was wanting something like this. I just didn't know like which one to get. I've seen different ones, like little like baby books. I love that this is a journal style. I, and I love that it's prompted as well because I never know like what to journal about and i also love that it's pink thank you so much Brittany. you're completely right i did not register for anything like this and i also don't have anything like this it says from the womb to 18 years old oh my gosh i'm gonna have to open this up and see if there's anything that i can put into it now but thank you so much Brittany. i just got a pr package in the mail now <laughs> that's why poncho was barking <laughs> okay i have one more package to open and it's the massive one that was delivered mid video. So <laughs> let's go ahead and open this up. See what we got in here. This box is huge. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm looking for, oh, I see papers at the bottom. Daniela, enjoy your gift. I hope you like them. Daniela, there's like several of these papers again. <sighs> Wow, okay, I, I haven't even looked at what's in here, but there's, I see several items, so let's see. 
First up we have, oh this is so cute. This is from Mom Cozy. This is the Smart White Noise Machine. It looks like it's a uh, nightlight. So it's a nightlight and it has app smart control, 34 sounds, a timer, child lock, program reminder. Um, you can like set favorites and there's also a headphone jack as well. How fun. So now we can have a nice like nightlight sound machine in our in our room as well as in the nursery. This is absolutely perfect. And I've heard really good things about the brand Mom Cozy. This is the first thing that I have from them. I have been recommended their products and also heard amazing things. So thank you so much, Daniela. Oh boy, more papers. <laughs> okay, let's see. Next we have, oh, the mushy pacifier case. So um, this is to like, put a pacifier inside of. I think this is silicone. It says it's 100% BPA free, suitable for any pacifier brand and it's dishwasher safe. So you can attach this to like your diaper bag or stroller or car seat or whatever um, and put the pacifier in here for safekeeping. It's kind of like an alternative to pacifier clip. So thank you so much for that, Daniela. I love the color of it. It's so perfect. Next we have some fitted crib sheets. These are so cute. I love the um, colors of these. There's like a cream color and a really pretty tan color as well. These are from Key Babies. They are Soothe Fitted Crib Sheets. Thank you so much, Daniela. I love the colors. They are so perfect. And then finally, we have this box here which i don't know what this is it's just like a cardboard box so let's open this up and see what we have inside oh yay we have hangers oh this is so exciting i cannot wait to hang up her clothes i i'm excited to hang and wash everything i i know it's gonna be like probably like redundant but i think i'm gonna hang everything like when we're like setting everything up and then I'll like wash everything when we get a little bit closer but I'm just too impatient to like hang things but I also want to wash things a little bit closer to her due date but we have a ton of hangers in here this is absolutely perfect some baby hangers so this should be plenty to completely cover all of her clothes <laughs> that need to be hung. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Daniela. This is absolutely perfect. I appreciate you guys so, so much. We have just been showered with love and gifts and I just thank you all so, so, so much. I have to get all of these boxes out of here put away we'll put um we'll kind of do a little organizing and put the stuff that i just opened up with the rest of the things that i previously showed you also um i do see that i have some um, packages that are like still to be delivered this week so if you send something and you haven't seen it in um, in unboxing yet you know uh, they're still you know if it hasn't gotten here yet if it hasn't been delivered no worries i will include it in a video if you send something it will be in a video um unboxed so that i can say thank you so thank you so much for everything you guys i'm just so uh, this is so cool so surreal so thank you so 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 much now um, i'm going to organize some of this stuff probably into the large box and then we will continue on with the room transformation process it's gonna be a several part thing because it's a huge project but um there's still a lot that i want to get done today so let's get started or let's continue <laughs> so here's a little update on the room i have all of this baby stuff up here everything from today's haul is in this box right here so i was able to fit that up there um this again is still the stuff I have to go through in some declutter videos. This is still a mess that we're going to have to address. Um, I have a few other baby things that are just like larger boxes or heavier boxes that just don't fit up here yet. Maybe once I move this stuff, I can fit some of this up here. But this is really heavy. This is a pack and play. So I'm going to have to have 
Jarvis helped me lift that and this box I'm pretty sure is also really heavy so <laughs> oh, there's a bunch of stuff in there we also have our changing pad in here so all of that is baby stuff um, I did clean up my hall area um, I also put away all those like yearbooks and stuff we moved those to the garage so cleared this out um i also emptied out all of these drawers i'm gonna have to like wipe these down spray them down and we're probably gonna end up selling these i did some measurements i think that my desk here is gonna fit in jarvis's office it'll be like our office now um i think that this one will fit on one wall for my computer um, and then he has one of these in his room already, which I can use to put my actual PC tower on so that there's a little bit more space. Um, and then I think that this one will work in there as well on the other wall. My camera cut me off, but as I was saying, I did some measurements and, um, I think this will fit in there as well. It'll definitely fit. I just don't want it to obstruct the walkway too much. So we'll have this as my makeup vanity in that room plus one of these Alex 9 drawer units and then this desk in there for my computer plus one of these which is already in there so these two we will go ahead and sell I emptied those out so I also moved out all of the decluttered makeup that I had in bags I put that in the laundry room for now just to make some space um, so yeah, that's kind of what things are looking like right now. Um, I do need to make some decisions about some of this stuff, so let's go ahead and run through that really quick. I think it's time that we say goodbye to these faux flowers. I loved these for so long. These were in the background of my video for, or my videos for years. Um, I loved them. <laughs> they still have the Marshalls tags on them. This one is $12.99. <laughs> I bought three of them and I just stuck them in this vase, which I, I'm going to keep the vase. It's still a really nice um, like pot vase kind of thing, but we are going to get rid of these. I'll probably um, donate them to Goodwill or something because they're still good. And like I said, they still have the tags on them. That's hilarious. I've literally had these since like 2019 maybe, 2018, 2019. So those we're going to donate. This I am going to keep though. Like I said, I think this still has the t sticker. Yeah, $12.99 from Marshalls for this. That was a good, good price. So this one we are going to keep. I'm going to move. I'm going to take it out of here though. I'm also going to take these crystals out of here. Um, those are makeup remover wipes. This is a jewelry box that I am going to be keeping, but my Chanel box we're also going to take out of here. So that's already cleared up some space on the floor here. Now I have a bunch of, okay, so I have some of these. Um, these are PR packages from Ofra. I have this Samantha March one, and then I also have this Ride or Die one, which these actually have the products. Let's see if I can open this. <laughs> these have the products inside. So I think I might do, um, I, I'm going to either do giveaways or just give them away and donate them. But both of these PR packages, I'm considering, or I'm considering these decluttered. Um, so these will either be in giveaways or I'll donate them or give them to a friend or something. Um, just because I'm pretty sure I have all of those products already. <laughs> and I'm trying to declutter my makeup collection if you didn't know. Um, then we have a bunch of these organizers. So I have these ones, which are from Amazon. I really enjoy this um, set. I also have, like, this one could be a potentially good one, so I might keep that one. Um, this one also is, like, a potentially good one. But I don't need this one. This is um, like a lipstick holder, so that one we're going to get rid of. I don't need these little white ones. These were really inexpensive. I'm pretty sure they were from Target or Walmart. Um, they lasted me a really long time, but 
Um, I just don't need those. So these ones we're definitely going to get rid of. These are more of the Amazon ones. So those will stay. These ones I'm pretty sure I got at the dollar store forever ago. They're like really gross and like... <laughs> They're just old. So these ones we're going, oh gosh, I almost fell. These we're gonna add to our declutter pile. The Amazon one can stay. Um, this is another dollar store one. Um, I don't think I'm gonna need that one. And then I have a couple of these, which I just don't think I'm gonna need these. So um, I think I'll just get rid of all three of these as well. So this one is a potential keep. I'm not 100% sure on these two. I have to clean them. <laughs> and then these ones are all from the Amazon set. These are the ones that I have in my everyday makeup drawers. I love them so much. I love this organizer set. I think I have two of them between this drawer, that drawer, and... Um, like my actual makeup drawers plus a few extras so for now we're gonna keep all of those I also have this which is like a bling kit <laughs> I was into like bedazzling things for a little bit towards the beginning of the pandemic I think I have something this was a little project that I started how cute is this <laughs> I started blinging this little boom boom cream from Sol de Janeiro I thought that that was so cute, um, but I haven't touched this in literal years. Um, these are all the crystals that I have, so I'm not really sure what I want to do with these, um, but I don't think that I need them, so I think I'll be able to get rid of these as well as these. So here's my update on the room. I got all of the boxes up here. This is all baby stuff for either the nursery or, you know, changing station, uh, what am I even trying to say? Um, <laughs> postpartum, literally anything baby related is up here. Um, the, I still have to figure out this section that I'll definitely be in the next part. We will address this messy corner, but I got everything off of the floor, all of this stuff. All this baby stuff is now up here, which is great that it's all in one place. Um, I still have some PR packages over here. Again, this is the makeup I still have to go through in declutter videos. That will be very, very soon. Um, and then I kind of cleared out the floor over here as well. I emptied out these drawers and um, kind of got rid of a few things over here. They're still kind of like a catch-all area here as well as over there so um, there's a few things on my desk I need to put away but for the most part things are looking pretty good um, like I said these two units are completely empty this one will be empty soon and then we'll kind of go from there I would love to have all of my hair care body care and skin care in our bathroom if possible I don't know if that's possible right now this is pretty full it's all in here but if I could take it all out empty this out and just put it under the sink in our bathroom that would be ideal I think but again don't know if that's possible at the moment but definitely something that's on my list to do we have a lot of stuff to still do but it feels good to kind of have a jump start on this space and have some open area that has been very cluttered and crowded for the last couple of weeks so I hope you enjoyed this next part and I'm excited to continue this process if you enjoyed don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up I love you so so much I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one bye